Welcome back to Lake Dardanelle in the Arkansas River Valley for the 2017 Cabela's Collegiate Bass Fishing Open. We'll get right back into tournament coverage with the team of Daniel Lemons and Ethan Raleigh representing Kentucky's Moorhead State University. The lake's fishing tough, but the fish it's giving up are actually really good fish. Even if it's a three by a day tournament. What are you thinking about right now? What are you looking for? Color-wise, I'm trying to find something like that without rattles. This has rattles. Something about, I don't know, five to eight foot deep. One thing yeah. our, our uh, teammates told us, every fish they caught, they were all completely full of shad. Yeah. So, then with just a little bit of flash, no, I don't want to really go with the crawl color. past the little ones. All right, I'm uh, Thomas Eikhoff, University of Iowa, exercise science major. I'm Austin Bartholomew, uh, University of Iowa, and uh, sport and rec management major. All right, we are on Lake Dardanelle doing some bass fishing. Very unsuccessfully at this point. We've been doing a lot of trying to pick apart shoreline structure with crankbaits, chatterbaits, pretty much anything moving. That's what we did yesterday. This is still really only my first year competing in tournaments and so is Austin. So we're still learning the whole series of tournaments and trying to get better as anglers and learn these lakes better to be able to compete with some of these other schools that have been doing it for a long time. There's got to be a fish in here somewhere. There's got to be a fish in here somewhere. This is Chad Moore and Ryan Neville fishing for Abilene's McMurray University. Well, this morning we started back here actually and caught a couple real quick, but a lot of boats came back here. So we got out and ran up to a couple bridges that we found pre-fishing and started cranking and wacky rigging some rocks and they were on them this morning. That boat like a keeper. Wasn't that boat in here this morning? Yeah, he wasn't here with us. Honestly, the rest of the afternoon looks tough with this wind uh, tomorrow. I think it's supposed to die from what I've seen, and I think it'll be a run and gun tomorrow. Uh, it's gonna, it's, tomorrow will be a better day, I think. Go on, go on. This is Miller Spivey and Logan Ledbetter. They're hooked up with go. their first fish of the weekend. There you go. We're throwing, uh, just white, regular old flathead swim jigs uh, with a, a twin tail zoom grub. And uh, that's just, I think the grub's just been the key this week. Uh, just, uh, we put swim baits on it. We threw them black and blue. It's just, I don't know what it is. I've even put this grub behind a spinner bait and they, they still whack it. But that's probably what, that's our main bait for this week. We have, I think, eight or 10 tied on them in the boat, so. 